Hello, I'm Helen White from Georgia, and it's a beautiful day today. And I'm out here today going to start a new project. I'm going to attempt to make a draped birdhouse. I, I've got this little pot that I'm going to use, and I'm going to drape it and let it dry and see how it turns out. I don't know. It might not turn out good, but we'll see. Thank y'all for watching this video, and have a blessed day. Thank you. Now I'm going to mix up a cement. This is a dirty <laughs> tub. This is my Portland cement. I'm just making a small batch today. This is my Georgia sand. Water. the end because it's got to soak up the, on this little cloth that I'm using. Okay. This is the plastic pot I'm going to use. And this is the cloth that I'm going to put in. This is for the pot. And I'm just going to drop it in there. i got to put my gloves on. This is my pot that I'm going to make my birdhouse with, and I'm going to leave the pot in there because it's just a throwaway pot. Okay. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put this draped, this big one. to put in it so I can keep it up. Okay, since this is a birdhouse, I've got to have a hole. I should have cut the hole first, I guess. But it'll be okay. I'm just going to put a clothespin right there for right now to hold it. Okay, I've got that. Now I need to move it. This is going to be the top of my birdhouse. I cut this flashing that goes on a chimney or roof of a house. I cut it to so it would be like a roof. And I'm going to put it together. I'm going to use my ice pick. I don't think you'll really be able to see this wire when I get, get the stuff on there.
you can get this at Home Depot. But I had some that was used out in out at my barn, and I went out there and cut a piece off. other little cloth that I put in there goes on the top of this. If this works, it will be light as a feather. <laughs> it's not going to be heavy at all. And I've got a little hanger that I'm going to put on it to uh, hang it up. Good morning. I'm Helen White from Georgia. And I'm out here this morning uh, showing you my uh, birdhouse, that, my draped birdhouse that I made the other day. And it's dry and it's ready to be painted and then I'm going to put the hook on it where you can hang it from a branch of a tree so I'm going to paint a, a little bit on it not a whole lot but just brighten it up a little bit uh, thank y'all for watching this video and have a blessed day and subscribe if you would like to thank you this is my very first draped birdhouse <laughs> it's not going to be a whole lot of painting just uh, brightening it up a little bit but I'm putting brown on to start with but, uh, then I'm going to put a lighter color I'm anxious to, for the spring to come so I can see if my birds like my bird houses I made. I'm sure they will. They love my yard. I have a mockingbird here that thinks he owns the pl whole place. And he runs off my other birds that try to eat. Okay, I'm going to take this off now. And okay. Now, I'm going to put a little green. I want it to resemble some moss. I love moss. <laughs> I'm putting some moss on my my birdhouse. I went in my backyard to get the moss and I found these little yellow flowers around there I thought was awesome this time of the year I'm gonna put them on here I know they're not gonna stay but I'm gonna put them on here to show that they was blooming in January
he's uh die I, i'll find some more to put up here okay here's my little hook that i'm going to hook on it that i made That looks great. Looks like spring. I'm gonna put a little drop of glue up here where this hole is. And I'm gonna put a little bit of moss up there. Okay, I'm I'm done with it. There's my birdhouse hanging in the tree that my birds like, and it's a big tree, and they love to get up in this tree and sit and sing and watch me. And I think my birdhouse turned out beautiful. I love the little yellow flowers I found in my backyard. So thank y'all for watching this video, and have a blessed day. Thank you.